Released on Christmas Day and directed by the one and only Steven Spielberg, this feel-good war epic stars Jeremy Irvine as a young Briton who falls in love with a plucky thoroughbred horse named Joey. When World War I breaks out, Joey is sold to the army and drifts from person to person during the war, going from one battlefield to the next, with his wishful owner hoping he'll someday return. He won't be any good in the war, neither. He, he shies at every sound. I'm sorry. What Joey's going on going to and volunteering? I see. What's your name, lad? Albert, sir. And how old 19, are you, Albert? Nineteen, sir. Is that the truth? No, sir, but, but I look nineteen and I'm bigger than most nineteen-year-olds and I'm, I'm strong, sir, and I'm not afraid of anything. I don't doubt your qualifications, Albert. But the law is very clear about the proper age for soldiering. It is a simple and kid-friendly story about the love of a pet that transcends all boundaries. Which is why it's unfortunate this plot thread is seemingly abandoned for the entire middle act, as Joey's owner is nowhere to be found. As expected though, this film is expertly directed and filmed by Spielberg, who makes full use of the European countryside, both before and during the First Great War. The acting is sufficient here, but sometimes it approaches soap opera levels of scenery chewing. Besides a clever scene between enemies who cease fire to help the injured Joey stuck in the barbed wire of no man's land, nothing particularly amazing or surprising ever occurs in this film. From the beginning, Joey the horse is seen as the underdog, but that never stops him from constantly impressing the doubtful humans taking care of him whether it's the German army or a small French girl who finds him in a windmill. This is a fun and delightful movie that plays everything by the book and never makes any missteps. But with a predictable ending, the film sorely lacks any real suspense or consequence and fails to really achieve a true level of greatness. War Horse, a heavy-handed inspiration of wartime. Those are my thoughts. Now let's see what you had to say about this movie in the YouTube comments. For the last time tonight, here's the Rhetomatic to score War Horse. A 7 and a 9. You love this film's presentation and its inspirational message. You scored it and awesome. While I appreciated everything this film accomplished, it didn't take any chances and it never really impressed me. But I thought it was cool. 